Hi everyone, my name is Cesar. I am the CEO and co-founder at Latitude. Latitude is a prompt engineering platform that helps you design, build, and deploy production-ready AI apps and agents. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create your own autonomous agent that can go online, it can do some research. In this case, our agent is gonna look for the latest news on AI and LLMs, and it's gonna create a summary, and then it will post that summary to a Slack channel. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is creating a new project. Let's call this one AI News Agent. And then in here, I will create a prompt from scratch. I will call it Agent, very simple. And I already have a prompt prepared, so let's just paste it and go over it. In this prompt, I'm telling the agent that's specialized in retrieving the latest news on AI and LLMs from multiple news outlets generating a summary with them and then posting them to the Slack channel named Inspiration. This is the Slack channel where we share most of the interesting links we find online. Then I'm breaking down the task in four steps. So to make it to make things easier for the for the LLM. Uh, and then I'm, I'm just adding a couple reminders down here. In order to make this agent work, I need to make some changes to the configuration. So first of all, I'm going to go to the configuration to the behavior section, and then I'm going to activate the agent type. What this does is it's gonna run the prompt in a loop until it reaches the goal, in this case, generating the summary and posting it to the Slack channel, and then it's gonna stop the loop. Um, apart from this, I also need to add some tools to my agent. So it can go online, it can do some searches, it can fetch the content from those articles, from those websites, and then also some tools so that it can post it to Slack. So let's go ahead in the built-in tools section we have here. We offer some built-in tools for your agents. Um, for this one, I'm gonna need the search one and the extract one. And from the Slack integration, this is an integration that uh, works through MCP. So as you can see, we're waking up the MCP server here. Um, the model context protocol is a very powerful way of integrating your agents with multiple services. Uh, we already have support for dozens of different MCP servers. So make sure to check them out in our integration section. Cool, so from the Slack integration, I need to list the channel so that I can find the uh, inspiration one. And then we also need the post message so that I can just post the message, very simple. So that's all we need. Let's just run the agent and see what happens. Cool, so we can see that it's already searching the web uh, for latest news on large language models, AI, some AI advancements and LLM developments. We can see that it already pulled some links uh, from those searches and it's already going ahead and fetching the content from those websites. So we can see that it's pulling content from TechCrunch, uh, from some other uh, blogs and news outlets. Let's see, there's a few of them. Cool, and here it finished the, all the tool calling and now we can see how the agent is producing that summary with all the different links. Um, once it finished uh, redacting that summary, it's calling the Slack tool to list the channel so that it can find the, the right one. Cool, so we can see here that this tool ended. Um, we can see that it was able to fetch the right channel ID for the inspiration channel. And here it's just posting the message. So let's just scroll to the bottom. Uh, we can see the final response by the agent. The summary of the latest AI news uh, has been successfully posted to the Slack channel inspiration. Cool, and we can see here that clearly was able to publish the summary with all the latest news to, um, to Slack. And that's it. That's all we need for our fully autonomous agent to run. Um, since I don't want to be running this manually, I'm also going to configure a trigger so that this happens automatically. So first of all, we need to publish the version so that it becomes live. We're publishing it to production. Awesome. And then let's head back to the agent. And here in the triggers, trigger section, we can uh, jump over to schedule. And then here I'm just going to specify that uh, I want this to run on Mondays at 9 a.m. I want it to repeat uh, this workflow every single week. So let's just save the changes. That's it. That's all we need um, for our fully autonomous agent to run every single Monday, uh, fetching the latest news on AI and, uh, on AI and LLMs, and then posting them to our Slack channel. As you can see, it was as simple as just creating this set of instructions all in natural language, and then adding some tools to the, to the agent. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful, and I'll see you in the next video.